Summer camps will soon be in session all across our region. Today, New Jersey Governor Phil Murphy announced new, less strict mask rules for campers and staff. Kimberly Davis has the story from Mount Laurel. Normalcy will finally return just in time for the start of the 2021 summer camp season. Last year, we spoke with one summer camp about the changes. This year, we caught up with that same camp to talk to them about the loosened restrictions. We're so excited um, to be able to bring some normalcy back to the kids. So we did hear about the guidelines are being updated. Those updated guidelines now allow vaccinated children and staff at New Jersey summer camps to ditch the masks outdoors and indoors. According to Governor Phil Murphy, those who aren't vaccinated are strongly encouraged to wear facial covering. The camp administrator for XL Sports World in Mount Laurel says she's waiting for the official guidelines to be released before making any decisions on unvaccinated children. I think it's going to be up to the parents. Um, I would like to take a look at the guidelines first because that was just a snippet of what the guidelines are going to be like um, before we make a final determination on that. Lynn says it's unclear if kids will have to show proof of vaccination or if it will be based on an honor system. Those new guidelines will be announced to summer camps on Wednesday. Last summer was um, obviously really restrictive. We weren't allowed to have field trips, we weren't allowed to do swimming, we couldn't have special guests, we couldn't allow anyone in the building, parents had to drop off and pick up outside. This summer will be almost normal as Lynn describes it and that's news parents she and her staff are glad to hear. I think that's going to be great for the kids this summer and to be able to run without their masks. I think it's going to be great. Normally about 950 kids are in that Mount Laurel location and about 750 children are at the Cherry Hill location. This year, Lynn tells me they expect to have about three quarters of that normal capacity and she tells me spots are filling up quickly. Reporting in Cherry Hill, I'm Kimberly Davis, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.